Good morning, my friend. Thank you so much for joining Johnny and I on the mat this morning. Let's set the intention to embrace all the elements that will fill up your day through the lens of light and love. Hop into something comfy, light a candle or burn some incense to set a loving mood and I'll meet you seated on the mat. Let's begin our practice by providing a gentle wake up to those hips. Bring your left shin in front of your right so it runs parallel with the short edge. And with a long spine, begin to hinge forward, leading with your heart. Only lowering as far as your body's guiding you for a feel good opening. We will hold this for about 10 to 15 breaths. As you breathe, notice if your body begins to open, allowing you to fold forward a little more with each breath you take. Option to invite in a slow, intentional sway side to side, only if it feels good. We'll settle into stillness at center and see if you can walk your palms forward a little more. From here, we'll twist at your navel to the left side space. Lower the back side of your elbow to the outside of your opposite leg. Make a fist with that hand and then wrap the opposite hand around that fist and really press and fuse them together to broaden across your chest. Go ahead and take your gaze towards the sky. With your inhales, find length in your spine. And on your exhales, really draw your navel back to your spine, pressing all the air out. Good, return to center. Rise and bring your fingertips behind you to lean back and switch out your legs. Right shin in front, running parallel with the short edge of the mat. We'll breathe in, find length. And on the exhale, hinge forward at your hip crease. Leading with your heart, lowering as far as your body's guiding you. Notice if your body's flexibility is different from one side to the next. And just appreciate being able to notice those subtle differences and respecting your body right where it's at. Return to those slow, steady breaths in and out your nose. As you breathe, notice if your body begins to open, allowing you to fold forward a little more. Now option to invite in that slow, intentional sway if you'd like, only if it feels good. We'll settle into stillness at center. See if you can walk your palms forward a little more, taking note of how much your hips have opened in this short time. Consider how much better you'll feel today as you walk through your day, taking this time to open your body, give it some love first thing. From here, twist at your navel to the right side. Lower the back side of your elbow to the outside of your leg again making a fist with that hand and then wrapping the opposite arm around it. Press and fuse them together. See if that creates space across your chest, your collarbone. Gaze to the sky. 
Inhales, lengthen. Exhales, draw navel back to your spine. Good. Return to center. Rise and bring your fingertips behind you to lean back. And this time, let's bring your soles of feet to kiss for a Baddha Konasana, also known as Bound Dangle or Butterfly Pose. Grasp along wherever is accessible and feels good in your body this morning. Your shins, ankles, big toes, or maybe round your tootsies. And with a vibrant, long spine, take a slow sway, a slow wave of your spine side to side. Massaging more into your hips, waking up your spine. Acknowledging that amazing movement of your spine. See if you can marry your breath with the movement. Finding a little yoga dance here. As you do this, begin to hinge forward. Now option to find stillness at center and round forward or continue to take that slow sway. Wherever you find yourself, rise up and extend your left leg out long. Opposite sole foot to your groin. Hips are open to the right side rather than squared up over the extended leg. And we'll slide your left arm down the inside of your extended leg. Opposite arm reaches up and over coming into a side body stretch. Lift your gaze under your arm and spiral your heart center towards the sky. Noticing if that allows your heart to shine towards the sky. Ground through that right sits bone. Invite a soft smile upon your face. Imagining that you're feeling that warm sunshine upon your face. And let's take a big breath in. And on the exhale, slowly lower that top arm to the mat like you're closing a clamshell. I don't know about you, but I never get tired of that visual. We'll bring your hands to frame your leg. Feel your hips square up over the extended leg and then fold forward. Maybe wild thing will be next. Sweep your right hand to the side and then behind placing your palm near your seat. Opposite arm sweeps forward up and back as you press and lift those hips towards the sky. Lifting to your right shin. Reach those fingertips back as you press and lift your hips up. Beautiful. Now on your next exhale, slowly lower your sits bones to the mat. Top arm sweeps forward and then circles behind you as the opposite arm reaches towards those toes. Holding in here for just a breath. Rise and bring your right sole foot to the mat near the inside of the opposite leg's thigh. And then we'll take it to the outside of your thigh. Breathe in. And on the exhale, begin your twist by wrapping your left arm around your leg. Opposite hand comes near your seat. Keep that beautiful long spine of yours. Collarbones broaden. And we'll return to center. Use your hands to slide your right heel near your left hip. Glance at your knees. We want your knees stacked one on top of the other. And then flex your extended foot. Breathe in, lengthen up through the crown of your head. Option to stay here or on the exhale, begin to hinge forward at your hip crease. Keep that nice flat back as you hinge. We'll soften and bring your fingertips behind to lean back, extend your leg out long, and we'll take that sequence over to the second side. The right leg will be extended and the left sole foot will be at your groin. Hip points open to the left side. Then slide your right arm down the inside of your extended leg, circling the opposite arm up and over. Fingertips reaching in the directions of your toes for our side body awakening. Gaze under your arm, knit your front ribs together, then spiral your heart center towards the sky. Check in with your left sits bone. If it's lifted, ground it down to the earth. Invite a soft smile upon your face. Big breath in, and on the exhale, slowly fan that top arm down to the mat. Bring hands to frame your leg, hip squared up over the extended leg, and fold. Good. 
Coming into baby well things, sweep your left arm to the left side and then behind, placing palm near your seat. Opposite arm sweeps forward, up and back, pressing and lifting those hips towards the sky. Reach those fingertips back as you lift your hips. Continue to breathe. Feel that opening along the front side of your body. On your ex exhalation, slowly lower your sits bones to the mat. Top arm sweeps forward and then behind. Opposite arm reaches towards your toes. One breath here. We'll rise and bring your left sole foot to the mat. And then cross it over to the outside of that thigh. Coming into your twist, breathe in, and on the exhale, begin your twist by wrapping your right arm around your leg, and the opposite hand will rest near your seat. Keep that beautiful long spine of yours. Collarbones are broadened. And return to center. Use your hands to slide your left heel near your right hip this time. Knees stacked one on top of the other and flex the extended foot. We'll breathe in, lengthen up the crown of your head. Explore what feels best on this side so you can stay here or exhale to hinge forward. Soften and bring fingertips behind to lean back and extend your leg out long. Let's do a little core wake up next in staff pose. So palms at your side. Let's flex your feet, toes reach back towards your body, Legs are energetically pressing down into the earth. Ground down through your sits bones, lengthen your tailbone to the earth. That lower belly is firming up and in. Knit your front rib cage together. Long spine, crown of head is reaching up towards the sky. Good work, my friend. Go ahead and soften and make your way to hands and knees. Wrists align under shoulders, knees under hip points. Breathe in to lower your belly and lift your gaze for cow. And while you hold it here, take your torso side to side, pressing through your right side body and then over to your left side body, feeling it out, stretching it out, finding what feels good. And we will exhale around through coming into cat pose. This time, rock front to back, rocking forward, creating even more space between your shoulder blades. Inhalation, wave your spine through into cow pose, feeling it out. Exhalation, round through your spine, coming into cat pose, feeling it out. Find neutral spine. Keep your hips stacked over your knees, just as they are, and walk your palms forward, coming into puppy pose. Lower your chest through center, forehead may kiss the earth. Or if it's accessible and feels safe in your body, you can lift your gaze and bring your chin to the mat. Waking up your chest and shoulders. Breathe deeply into your shoulders, your neck, your chest, and along your spine and your lower back. Let's gently lift your forehead and walk your palms back towards your body, coming into tabletop. And then we'll tuck your toes and lift hips to downward facing dog. Now in your down dog, take a slow, very subtle sway side to side, shifting your weight into one leg and then over to the other. Good. Now let's wake up your neck here in down dog with the weight of gravity gently pulling it down. Go ahead and shake your head side to side front to back, or maybe a few circles, whatever's calling to you. Find stillness at center and feel your beautiful body in this most feel-good downward facing dog. Shift your weight into your right sole foot and then take your left foot on top of your right so your foot rests between your big toe and your second toe. We're working into your hamstrings of your right leg a little more here by actively drawing your right heel closer towards the earth. Return your left toes to the mat, shift weight to that foot, and then take your right foot on top of your left this time, gently guiding your left heel closer to the earth. 
by the weight of your own body. Keep hips square, no dipping. Then return your right toes to the mat. We'll slowly walk your palms back towards your feet, towards the back of the mat. And as you do this, we'll bring your feet in to kiss. We're going to lower into a toe squat to wake up those toesies. So we'll lift your heels and then lower your hips to your heels. Now you can stay lowered with your fingertips to the mat or option to lift and bring hands prayer to heart center. Soft gaze forward upon your dristi, or if you want to challenge yourself a little more, you can try closing your eyes. Now while holding here, prayer at heart center, let's return to our intention. Has this practice helped set the tone to embrace all the elements that will fill up your day through the lens of light and love? Is your body and your heart awake and open for what is ahead? Feel your body in balance all those little micro movements that are happening to support you here just as all those little micro movements will happen throughout your day to help support you to feel balanced as long as you open yourself to them now with control lower your knees to the mat if those toes of yours have had all they can take go ahead and untuck your toes lowering your tops of feet to the mat otherwise hold it here and take a few wrist circles giving them some love waking them up both directions and then extend your arms out long point your fingertips down and then up towards the sky and back fanning them side to side a little release and take a few shoulder rolls as big or as small as your body's guiding you both directions if you haven't already release your tops of feet to the mat tips to heels Now with shoulders square, lower your right ear towards your right shoulder. Then slowly circle chin down towards your chest. Then up, left ear towards your left shoulder. Slowly circle chin to chest and take one more on your own. The next time your chin is lower to your chest, Hold it there and we'll take a big breath in to lift up to center. And take the biggest, most nourishing breath and circling your fingertips up to the sky, gathering love and light. Palms kiss the top and bring all that love and light down to your heart center. Now with a soft smile upon your face, take a moment here to visualize yourself walking through your day, embracing all the elements that will fill up your day through the lens of light and love. Bow forward, thanking yourself for taking this time this morning to cultivate a sense of balance for your day ahead to help you see how everything can work together, supported by the unique, amazing, special essence of you. Namaste. Thank you so much for practicing with me this morning. This would be a great meditation to follow up this practice with. If you enjoyed this practice, please throw the video a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, I'd be very grateful for you taking a moment now to do so, as this is one free and very, very easy way to help support our work to continue to release one free yoga practice a week, making yoga free and accessible to all. Sending so much love and so much light to you, my friends.